How can you make sure that SCADA alarms are properly acknowledged and responded to in a timely manner? Here are seven Affinity Energy best practices. Number one, stop alerting on events. The alarm designation should only be for actionable conditions. An event designation is more for FYI conditions that don't require operator action. Too many events classified as alarms could easily bury critical issues. Number two, stop relying on the manufacturer's points list. The manufacturer's points list is a great starting point when setting up alarms, but it doesn't cover everything. System integrators should work with owners to identify specific alarm conditions that apply to each facility's unique equipment. Number three, stop sending alarms to everyone. Alarms should be on a need-to-know basis. Don't alert your chiller tech to generator issues or your network techs to boiler issues. Blasting out alarms is distracting. Define alarm groups, and if alarms aren't acknowledged within the time frame allotted, they should automatically escalate. Number four, stop alarming on obvious issues. Sometimes a high-priority alarm starts a cascade of not-so-critical alarms. These nuisance alarms just promote operator apathy. Ask your SCADA integrator to build functionality into the system that reduces cascading alarms. Number five, stop alarming during maintenance. Testing and maintenance of equipment or systems can often result in nuisance alarms or events. Using alarm suppression capabilities or conditional alarming is a great way to eliminate those. Number six, stop sharing user logins. The best way to avoid missed critical alarms is when operators are kept responsible through unique individual user logins. Don't use one generic user ID for all operators. If each operator action is logged, it's easy to see who's responsible when something slips through the cracks. Lastly, number seven, stop using the Acknowledge All button. Often, operators inundated with pages of alarms will simply click the Acknowledge All button instead of individually looking at all alarms. The danger? They might lose visibility to a buried high priority alarm. Stop the need for this button by keeping alarms manageable with the tips discussed in this video. Remember, a smarter alarm system makes a more efficient, safer, and profitable facility. Let us know if you need help setting up a smart alarming SCADA system.